Hi everybody, I've had a lot of questions about the products I use to make my wreaths and also to decorate the stairs. So I just kind of wanted to give y'all a little, little video. Excuse me if you hear the dog or children in the background, but you know, that's life as y'all all know. Okay, this is called a work wreath. Um, you can also use an old green Christmas tree wreath, uh, which I have in the past, but these are less bulky and you can get, it, get the colors to match your mesh. This is called Deco Poly Mesh or Deco Mesh. Some people call it Geo Mesh. These run about $7.50. Some of the more um, intricate ones that have uh, metallic flex in it can be about $11, but it's fairly reasonable and it's I mean, 10 yards on there. And it, it takes about one of these to make a wreath, depending on how full you like it. So I'm just gonna kinda give you a little demonstration of how you start this. I already have one open. This is what it looks like. It's real easy. You just wad it up like this. And I like to start with the inside. There's two rows, the inside and then the outside. I do the entire inside first, and then I come down and do, without cutting it, and, and do the outside, and then I cut it. So you just gather it, tuck it in, twist it, and then you spread it out a little bit, wad it up, go to the next one, twist it like it's wire. Twist the wreath around, gather up some more, and you'll just continue this all the way around. So that's how I start the basis of my wreath. And I'll give you a picture of it when I'm finished. There's really no wrong way to do it. It's just however full you like it. And just continue to pull it out, bunch it up, and twist it like that. And it secures, it's very, very easy. And it has a lot of impact. So I hope that helps. Um, I get my re uh, poly mesh at a place in Oklahoma City that has pretty much every color you can imagine. But also TrendyTree.com trendy has um, all kinds as well, and they're super fast on their shipping. So thanks a lot.